am Bex from Channel Bex Bug Out Survivor and today I've been making my own hot lick. I've made about three of these so far. Uh, this is the GSI Glacier. Um, I've also done one for the Crusader Mark 1 and I've also made one for the Yugoslavian mess tin. Yeah, they're relatively simple to make. This is probably my favourite. What you're going to need is an aluminium army style canteen. That's what we're going to make the lids from. I've used a wooden handle which can be screwed from underneath. Tin snips or a jigsaw if you like and a little toffee hammer that's all I use okay let's have a go at making the Crusader pot lid so one stop making some lids for my cups and I also have the glazier to do as well but I want to just start on this and it's these things here that are going to make the lid they're very old mess tins these are aluminium and it shouldn't be too difficult um, I think I might use a sharpie for this and as you can imagine I turn the mess tin upside down the cup of choice upside down and I want to measure it up because I need to have a 5mm overhang around this. So here we go, draw around this first. Okay, that's the first job done. Now to give this, say, 5mm lip, the overhang, what I've chosen to do is find something that's about a centimetre, this is a one penny piece UK and I've cut around it using some thin card because this is a centimetre half of it will be five mil and if I place that on there put a pen in I can draw around to get the overhang lip that I need push that against the edge and go around Well it's not absolutely perfect, especially round here, so I'm going to tidy up and then we're going to come back and cut this out along this outside edge. Just want to make sure I do have the full 5mm. Now using my left and right tin snips, I'm going to cut around the very outer edge of this. Now. Um, as far as I can see the outside edge should be 5mm and it cuts with relative ease the first cut is going to be quite some way around here just to give myself room for error This curve. And the same on the other side, cut the corners and take the end off. Okay, time to follow the outside line. I'm going to uh, come to the outside edge of this line, not the inside. I need a little more room to work with. I'll start coming in to this outside edge. Take this quite slowly here. Now I have um, a couple of cup cups that I want to try out with. Uh, the glacier cup will be interesting to do. 
Um, that's perfectly round, the glacier cut. This has more of a kidney shape. Okay, let's work out how I'm going to do this. So if I rest the original form here on the base, I should be able to get this overhang edge here, which just needs tapping down with a very small hammer and that is as technical as I'm doing uh, just for the original practice one and I've got a few of these military canteens so I can make a few lids okay using a pair of pliers I can take the inside edge and just gently bend down not all the way, I just want to start folding it over. We'll worry about the smaller details with this toffee hammer down here a little later. Now I don't know how I'm going to get on with making a perfectly round one. It's not as easy as it looks. Okay, we're getting there. I want to just take more care on these corners and neaten everything up. That's got a terrible crimp in it just there. Uh, see if I can take that out just with the pliers. Okay, I'm going to take some care now to go around this in the same manner you've just seen. It's not the neatest job in the world but a bit of time and care and uh, it'll be a workable unit Okay, it's taken form a little bit more to do. Got too much depth on this side. Let me see if this will sand up and maybe give it a nicer finish. Now I did have um, a brass device here. This is all I can find for now. Let's see if I can sand it up a bit. I wish I could find my brass wheel just to clean it a little, give it a, a showroom finish. I want to play about with this a lot more, but um, in fact, that is a good fit. That is a really good fit. A little high here. I've got more than the 5mm I allowed for. And on the front, I've got about three. All in all, it's not too bad. Um, if I can find my brass wheel, I'm going to clean it all up. But I'm going to see if I can put a handle in the centre of this. Yugoslavian mess tin. Lemon squeezy.